Good morning Bulldogs, I'm Anthony Rourke. And I'm Sarah Hayes. And welcome to the BNN News Show. This week we'll be showing you more on I Step, the Jazz Competition, Bull for Kids Sake, and the Dance Marathon. Check out this segment to learn more on North students taking I-STEP. The sophomore class is taking I-STEP. BNN talked with Cherokee Lions and Gretchen Bless to learn their opinions on the testing. I think taking I-STEP wasn't really that hard because like we've taken it like our whole lives and we only have to pass either the I-STEP or the ECA. I think that taking the ECA and the I-STEP this year is beneficial to all of us because it's giving us two chances to take a test. I think it's important to take I-STEP to help you figure out what you like know in English and your strengths in it. It did help me recognize the strengths and weaknesses because I can't write that well. <laughs> the hardest part was probably sitting in a room for like a couple periods at a time. It wasn't that hard. The hardest part about the test for me was reading all the passages all the way through because I get bored. This is Morgan Smith reporting for BNN. Watch this segment for more on the jazz competition. Jazz contest is this Saturday. Zach White tells us more on where the contest will be held and which bands are playing. Our contest is at Whiteland High School. We'll be playing uh, jazz and there'll be three different jazz bands. There are Jazz 3, Jazz 2, and Jazz 1, of course. Zach White also explains why students should come out and support the jazz groups. If they like jazz, it would be a good thing for them to come and watch and also it's like our last jazz competition before we have jazz all mode at the end of the year so there's a big gap in between when we perform next. This is Sarah Hayes reporting for BNN. Watch this segment for more on Bull for Kids Sake. This Saturday at the Columbus Bowling Center, Bull for a Kids Sake, a fundraiser to help money for big brothers, big sisters is March 5th. BNN sat down with Mrs. Burbrink to find out more. Well, it's sponsored by the Foundation for Youth. It's called Bowl for Kids Sake and it's an annual fundraiser for Big Brothers Big Sisters. This Saturday it starts at 9 o'clock and it runs all day. Um, each team needs to raise at least $375 and the proceeds will go to Big Brothers Big Sisters and it's a lot of fun. Just get a team together and come see me and you can find out more information. In order to participate you need to choose a five-person team and raise $375. See Mrs. Burbrink in room 2013 for more details. This is Kobe Grave reporting for BNN. For more on Dance Marathon, watch this segment. Saturday is Dance Marathon. BNN caught up with Chase Millwood and Lindsay Rose to learn more about Dance Marathon. I'm Chase Millwood. I'm a senior here at Columbus North, and I'm the co-chair of Dance Marathon this year. So I'm just on the food committee, and so I'll just be passing out food all night. We have a lot of good things for everyone. Um, and it's $20 to get in, but $75 for a VIP. The VIP for food anyway will get like some things that other people won't, like chocolate smoothie is one of those. Um, and then like there's some extra like ice cream things probably too. Uh, Dance Marathon is a 12 hour event. It starts at 8 p.m. on March 5th and goes till 8 a.m. on March 6th. So that's this weekend, Saturday to Sunday. Um, it benefits Turning Point, which is the domestic violence service here in Bartholomew County and the surrounding seven counties and it really goes a long way to impact the community and help people in bad situations. At the dance we have lots of food, lots of prizes, there are plenty of great things to win. We have lots of games like uh, Human Jenga, Human Foosball, uh, we have lots of great bands and DJs playing. So this year we have uh, $6,000 in scholarships for seniors just for attending. And so if you want to come, it is March 5th, 8 o'clock. Show up with $20 to get in or $75 to be VIP. And we really encourage you to not just ask for that or pay for that for yourself, but to actually just sort of ask your family, ask friends, and sort of fundraise. This is Anthony Rourke reporting for BNN. That's it for today, Bulldogs. I'm Anthony Rourke. And I'm Sarah Hayes. Have a great day. If you'd like an announcement on the show, please email nhs underscore communications at bcsc.k12.in.us. BNN is a proud partner of CNHS Media at Columbus North in Columbus, Indiana. 
All music is provided by American Music Company.